Is it? Okay. This is Galatians 4 and 22. For it is written that Abraham had two sons. The one by a bondmaid. Slave. Sarah. I mean, uh, Haggit. The other by a free woman. Sarah. Because that was actually his wife. But he whom was of a bond woman was born after the flesh. Which is Ishmael. Right, because he's of this world. Exactly. The Lord said he was going to promise them a seed. They had to wait 10 years before they got that seed. Which came Isaac. But he of a free woman was by promise. Mm -hmm. That's it. That's it. That was just yeah, it. yeah, that was the point. It threw the mothers in there since you heirs like to worship mothers and Mother's right. Day. Well, y'all mother was a slave. Yeah, 76. This is uh, Deuteronomy chapter 7, verse 6. For thou art an holy people unto the Lord thy God. Right, speaking of the 12 tribes of Israel. Jake. The Lord thy God hath chosen thee. Right, see, he chose us. You don't find and choose the Lord. Right. Exactly. The Lord thy God hath chosen thee to be a special people unto himself. Above all people that are upon the face of the earth. Right. So we're you not got, all equal in this world. Right. Because you got all these nations. That's why we broke down the tables of nations first. Right. But that one nation of Israel is above everybody on the face of the earth. Yeah. Right. We got superiority over every nation in the world. Exactly right. The because Lord, we was chosen. Go ahead, I'm sorry. The Lord did not set his love upon you, nor choose you, because ye were more in number mm -hmm. than any people. But ye were the fewest of all people. But because the Lord loved you, and because he would keep the oath which he had sworn unto your fathers. Right, which was Abraham. That oath, which was that covenant that he um, gave Abraham before Isaac was born. Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Right, that's, that, that's, that, that's the promise. Hath the Lord brought you out with a mighty hand mm -hmm. and redeemed you out of the house of Bond, bond. Right, bondage. Egypt. Right, only one group of people came out of Egypt, man. Everybody know this story. Exactly. So that's how we know it's talking about the Israelites. They always wanted to, you got to say it. Right. Why well, you think the church finally, slavery. well, they ain't come out of Egypt. Right. I don't right. know what slavery you was in. Right. That's, that's why the church said that the Israelites was done away with, because exactly. they can't go around them stories. Exactly. From the hand of Pharaoh, king of Egypt, which is the Africans. Uh, know therefore that the Lord thy God, he is God, the faithful God, which keepeth covenant and mercy with them that love him and keep his commandments to a thousand generations. Right. right. So if you love the Lord, you keep the commandments. <laughs> To a thousand, we ain't even had a thousand generations. Exactly, right. So, so forever. <laughs> right, he made sure he knew exactly. All right, that's it. All right, Amos 3 and 1. Hear this word that the Lord has spoken against you, O children of Israel, against the whole family which I brought up from the land of Egypt. That's the 12 tribes. You only have I known of all the families of the earth. We're the only ones he deal with because he's the only ones we gave his glorious law, statutes, and commandments to do according to what said, his son and he say. That's why he say, I only loved you. To receive the promises. I only knew you. To know the Lord, you got to know how he think and feel. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Therefore, I will punish you for all your iniquities. Right, that's why we had those curses put on us. Right. The previous we went through in the last video. There's only one way to get them off you. Right, you gotta come back to this book. Okay, that's it. That's it. This is Psalm 147 and 19. He showed his word unto Jacob, mm -hmm. which is the 12 tribes of Israel, the progenitor of the 12 tribes of Israel. His statutes and his judgments unto Israel. Mm -hmm. He had not dealt so with any nation. Right, you just said he has not dealt with any nation. He only dealt with the twelve tribes of Israel. But Black, they, but Black Native Indians. but they gonna lump the white man in that all. Right, right. the white man, the Arab. Because they Africans. want, they want to love him, so the Lord gotta love him. Right. But Christians. what the Lord say though? He hath not dealt so, hath not dealt so with any nation. Right, no nation. But they gonna try to squeeze that John three sixteen and say you love everybody. But they gotta get a complete story from Isaiah. Right, and as for. 
his judgments, mm -hmm. they have not known them. Why do you think all the rest of the nations are living prosperous while y'all running around here struggling day to day? Praise ye the Lord. Okay. I do the right of me 14 and 2. For thou art an holy people unto the Lord thy power. And, and the Lord has chosen thee to be a peculiar people unto himself. Chosen thee, the Israelites, a peculiar people. Above all the nations above all the nations that are upon the earth. So now, it keeps saying that nation, so it proves that it's different nations. Exactly. We ain't all the same. We got different... Um, Lineages. Lineages. We got different right. manners of how we act, talk, walk, and everything. And we just broke down who all the nations is, who everybody came from. So that fake nigga who talking about God uh, help us or bless us or whatever, you better tell the university to go help your ass. Right. And it keeps saying Israel. It's not saying Africans. It's not saying foot. Um, Edom. Edom. Right. right. No other name come up. This is uh, Ecclesiasticus chapter 17, verse 17. Mm -hmm. For in the division of the nations. Right. So remember it said he divided the nation. Exactly, of the whole earth. Right. He set a ruler over every people. But Israel mm -hmm. is the Lord's portion. They just repeat it again. Israel is the Lord's portion. If the Lord, if that's his portion, that means that's a special group unto him. Yeah. Whom being his first. Okay, that was it. Yeah, that's it. That's it. Okay, that was the end on a few scriptures, precepts to give y'all for the Lord deals with Israel. We can do plenty more. Right. But the next topic is other nations to the Lord are nothing. Right. Right, because right, we now that know that he only deals with Israel. Israel, so how do we feel about the other nations? Right, That's the about? point, and let's let the scriptures speak on it. Not how, not how we feel, right. but how the Lord feel. Now, see, that's why they don't teach this nationality out the Bible. Mm -hmm. This is Isaiah 40 and 17. All nations before him are as nothing. And they are counted to him less than nothing. See that? That's blunt. And vanity. Yep, right. I ain't got to say nothing on that. Right, just playing. That's all I got to say is it sucks to be you. Yeah. 2nd <laughs> Ezra was 6, chapter 6, verse 54. After, and after these, Adam, also whom thou madest Lord over all thy creatures. Which is him, all thou people. Of him come we up. Right, because we all say, oh, we all come out of hell. Exactly. And the people also whom thou hast chosen. Right, because it was Adamites, then it was the sons of God, yep. then it was the Hebrews, then it was the Israelites. Right. So you fake-ass, Egyptology-ass niggas, y'all better hope y'all don't run into our camp or run into none of these GMS camps because y'all ain't ready. Y'all right. information is like the Arabs, I mean the uh, Islamic people. It's outdated. Right. It says, all of this. Is that, is that the no, just keep going back. Yeah. It says, all of this have I spoken before thee, O Lord, because thou madest the world for our sakes. Right. Though the world was made for the twelve tribes of Israel. Right. That's why we say, if the Lord made the world and your father gave, talking about he gonna give you an inheritance. What inheritance is he gonna give you? The world. That's why he said all the the um. The, the holy days, according to the um, the way that the uh, Israelites have to live, all of their holidays and their seasons go by, the, you know, the Lord and the scriptures for us, because the word is made for our sake. As for the other people, which is the other nation, right, he called them other people, which also come of Adam. Right, since we all come from Adam, let's see what we say about y'all. Thou hast said that they are nothing. And that's the second time now. But be like unto spittle. Right, spit. And has likened the abundance of them unto a drop that falleth from a vessel. Right, so if you got a big old cup of water and you happen to be walking with it and you spill some, you don't panic and all go berserk because you <laughs> spilled that little drop. Right. You, you look back and keep walking. Right. Like I got a whole cup in front of me. Right. I did it last night going to work. 
Okay, this is um, Zeph 